I actually had a horse that helped me appreciate the amazing process of change. When our children were young, my wife and I looked for a gentle, well-broke children's horse. Our neighbor had such a horse, but he would sell us kind and gentle Bob only if we bought his other horse, Stubby. The names alone described the horses, and Stubby ended up being, as expected, a stubborn, strong-willed, obnoxious animal that consistently acted up and caused trouble. I decided to do all I could to bring about a change in Stubby's disposition. I gave him consequences for bad behavior and rewarded him for good behavior. Over a period of 10 to 15 years, Stubby developed into an exceptional lead horse. He began allowing me to guide and control him without resistance. In fact, Stubby made such a turnaround that we changed his name to Spinner. We would say in horse lingo that he was well broke. Spinner gave up his natural will and aligned his will with his master's will. In a similar, though much more meaningful way, we are invited to change. In the New Testament we read, Submit yourselves therefore to God. Resist the devil and he will flee from you. Draw nigh to God and he will draw nigh to you. Blessings do come as we submit our will to Heavenly Father. And the more fully we submit our will to Him, the richer the blessings. 